Every iconic brand has its origin story, a tale that merges business acumen with cultural evolution. Enterprise Epics dives into these narratives, exploring the transformative journeys of institutions that have left an indelible mark. This chapter unveils the remarkable evolution of steak and shake, not just as a diner, but as a testament to the power of vision and the pursuit of excellence in the world of enterprise. In the vast tapestry of American culinary culture, few establishments evoke as much nostalgia and admiration as Steak and Shake. From the aroma of sizzling steak burgers to the rich taste of hand-dipped milkshakes, this restaurant chain has woven itself into the very fabric of the nation's gastronomic journey. Born amidst the adversities of the Great Depression and charting a trajectory that intersects with cultural, economic, and entrepreneurial shifts, Steak and Shake's story is not just about food. It's a tale of ambition, resilience, and the ever-evolving American spirit. As we embark on this exploration, we'll discover how a simple concept of steak in a burger transformed into a culinary institution that has stood the test of time. Did you know that a simple gas station could morph into one of the most iconic diners we recognize today? Hold on to your seats, because we're about to dive into the tumultuous yet fascinating journey of steak and shake. The diner's promise is simple delectable steak burgers, and velvety milkshakes. And, though their footprint has ebbed and flowed over time, their essence remains undeniable. With over 500 locations, predominantly in the Midwest, but also dotting the Eastern U.S., their history is rich and varied. The 90-year tapestry of steak and shake is painted with numerous custodians, each leaving an indelible mark. Imagine, a venture that began as a humble gas station in normal Illinois, by Gus Belt and his wife Edith. Times were tough. The Great Depression's shadows loomed large. But adversity often breeds creativity. The duo decided to incorporate a restaurant within their gas station, presenting an all-you-can-eat chicken dish and even offering beer on the side. While beer became an attraction, the direction soon changed, and with a small loan, they pivoted. Consider the socio-political landscape when Steak and Shake was born. The 1930s was an era of economic despair, and starting a business was not for the faint-hearted. The very fact that Gus and Edith Belt dared to dream and actualize their vision amidst such adversity is a testament to their grit and determination. They didn't just open a diner, they started a movement, one that emphasized quality, trust, and transparency. 1934 marked the turning point when they shed the gas station persona, introducing a burger joint named Steak and Shake. Their unique selling proposition? Burgers made from steak. Gus showcased the grinding process openly, emphasizing the quality of their ingredients. As time went on, the menu evolved, adding more than just burgers. It was the commitment to fresh quality ingredients that set steak and shake apart. The brand's motto, Insight It Must Be Right, wasn't merely a catchy slogan. It encapsulated their business ethos. Freshly baked buns, real ice cream for shakes, and hand-cut fries became the standard offerings of steak and shake, creating a delightful dining experience that was both hearty and genuine. The 1950s and 60s brought a boom in car culture in America. Drive-in movies, car hops, and cruising became popular pastimes. Sensing an opportunity, Steak and Shake started offering curbside service. Teenagers and families alike would drive up, place their orders, and enjoy their meals without ever leaving their cars. These innovations, while seeming trivial today, were groundbreaking at the time and further solidified Steak and Shake's place in American culture. The aesthetic of the restaurants also played a role in their charm. Black and white tiled floors, gleaming counters, and comfortable booths created an ambiance reminiscent of classic American diners. The atmosphere was not just inviting, it was familiar, evoking a sense of timeless Americana. Their success blueprint was replicated across Illinois, expanding to places like Missouri, Arkansas, and Florida. Their growth trajectory saw several leadership changes, from Edith Belt after Gus's untimely death, to new corporate owners like Longchamps and Franklin Corporation, each influencing the company's direction. Now, if you're enjoying this dive into Steak and Shake's legacy, remember to hit that subscribe button for more engaging content from Enterprise Epics. Franklin Corporation's era was marked by aggressive expansion, doubling locations, and adopting modern drive throughs Yet, the most transformative phase came under Ed Kelly's aegis. With a vision to rekindle the diner's classic roots, 
he initiated a massive expansion from 130 to almost 500 restaurants. They revisited their vintage aesthetics, and by the turn of the millennium, their brand was synonymous with a timeless retro charm. However, like any epic tale, challenges ensued. External factors like harsh winters and fuel prices were blamed for declining sales. Yet, the real hero, or perhaps the anti-hero of our story, is Big Larry and his Big Larry Holdings. His vision was clear-cut, efficient, high-volume sales with minimal margins. This meant streamlining menus and standardizing prices across all outlets. For a while, this strategy seemed to work wonders. But, as we know, every action has an equal and opposite reaction. Big Larry Holdings' diversified interests meant that Steak and Shake's profits were spread thin, often invested in unrelated ventures. Steak and Shake faced the brunt of neglect as profits poured into other sectors. Outdated equipment and infrastructure began to impact their core efficiency-driven model. Lastly, it's pivotal to discuss the lessons Steak and Shake imparts on corporate responsibility. While Big Larry Holdings' approach might have initially seemed successful, it underscores a vital business truth. Short-term gains achieved at the expense of core values and long-term sustainability are perilous. For every decision, stakeholders and long-term implications should be central considerations. Perhaps the lesson here is the importance of reinvesting in one's golden goose, especially when it lays such delicious steak burger eggs. Steak and Shake's story also holds lessons for budding entrepreneurs. It underscores the significance of understanding one's unique value proposition. Their emphasis on steak burgers set them apart in a saturated market. Moreover, their willingness to pivot when necessary, like moving away from the gas station model, reveals the essence of adaptability. Another takeaway is the power of branding. Steak and Shake maintained a consistent brand image. Whether it was Gus grinding steaks in front of patrons or their timeless diner aesthetics, they created a recognizable and trustable brand presence. Furthermore, the brand's oscillating fortunes under different leadership styles shed light on management's role in shaping a company's destiny. While some leaders prioritized expansion, others aimed to streamline and optimize operations. As the tale unfolds, it's clear that Steak and Shake's story is more than a corporate chronicle. It's an allegory of ambition, adaptation, resilience, and rejuvenation. Their narrative intertwines with the very fabric of America's history, culture, and aspirations. To all budding entrepreneurs, industry veterans, and even everyday patrons, Steak and Shake stands as a beacon, highlighting both the rewards of perseverance and the pitfalls of deviation. Their legacy is not just etched in their outlets, but also in the annals of entrepreneurial lore. In today's fast-paced world, Steak and Shake stands as a testament to the importance of staying true to one's roots. Their story is not just about burgers and shakes, but also about passion, vision, adaptability, and endurance. In conclusion, the story of Steak and Shake is one of evolution, resilience, and adaptation. Their journey reminds us of the power of vision, the risks of diversion, and the timeless appeal of quality. So, the next time you bite into a juicy steak burger, or sip on a creamy milkshake from Steak and Shake, remember the legacy behind every morsel and drop. And perhaps, let it inspire you to write your own enterprise epic. If you've been captivated by this epic enterprise tale, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to Enterprise Epics for more riveting stories from the world of business.